Can I tell you something about Jake Gyllenhaal right now? Okay, forget what you saw in Road Rage, Roadkill, Roadhouse, whatever he did. It was an embarrassment. He was, he, he was built, yeah, and, and that was great. But his character was just like so boring. He was such a boring, boring person. And that's so not Jake Gyllenhaal. Jake Gyllenhaal, why, why'd you pick that role? Why? I mean, I enjoyed your fight scenes. I've seen some things, some, some close combat that I hadn't seen before. Thank you for that, Jake Gyllenhaal. And the Irish guy, what's your name? He cracked me up. He's really good. Can't think of his name. Sorry, buddy. I'm out of touch. Jake Gyllenhaal, what you're best in is this show I'm watching. I'm telling you what. Presumed Innocence. Y'all, you want to see a, a TV series about some uh, defense uh, attorney who uh, it kind of gets framed or accused of, uh, you know, a murder? And it's Jake Gyllenhaal. <laughs> so, like, throughout the entire series, you don't know. From episode to episode, new things keep revealing themselves. You can't trust anybody, any character in the cast. You don't know what's going to happen. I'm not even at the end. I'm at the like the second to the last episode. And I, I have no idea what to expect. Who done it? Who did it? Who done it? <laughs> so many curveballs and presumed innocence. And I want to thank you from the bottom of my heart, Jake Gyllenhaal. Also, Johnny Cash, thank you. From the beyond. Youngsters, Johnny Cash was a white man who dressed in black. That's all he's known for. That's it. <laughs> Great musician. Did he inspire Trent Reznor? He inspired so many people. Uh, you might recognize his voice if you heard it. Now, uh, speaking of being in black, I finally uh, upgraded. I think I've evolved from those skinny blue jeans to some sexy, suave, slim, slender um, black jeans. Like, just, I really... I, the way I judge myself and my appearance is how I look in the reflection of a window as I'm approaching a retail store. <laughs> I'm like walking up to it all proud and noble in black. And I'm like, man, that guy looks good. And I'm like, yes, Johnny Cash. Also, Peter Dinklage, thank you for all you've ever done. Because I don't know if you're equal to or better than Robert Downey Jr. But Peter Dinklage, little man from uh, Game of Thrones. Yes, everything you do is fucking gold. I'm just celebrity vomiting right now. These names. Who else? Who else? Is, that, is there anybody else? Is there anybody else? <laughs> I'm glad Weird Al is still doing it. Weird Al Yankovic is still blowing shit up. Dude, he released a new album, and I can't wait to hear that. I love Polka. I mean, I lied. I don't love Polka. I don't love Polka, but if anybody was to persuade me in the direction of loving Polka music, it'd be Weird Al Yankovic. Yankovic, Jankovic, Humperdinck, Peter Dinklage. It would be Peter Dinklage persuading me to enjoy Weird Al Yankovic Dinklage. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Gotta go. Bye.